What's going on guys and welcome back to Fury Farms. Now last time, or uh, the way I ended it, ooh, I'm going to build track there because I was looking at what I was doing. Um, on the last episode, we figured out that you could do missions for other people, which is actually quite good. Why is that going like that? Yeah, anyway, we, could, we figured out you can pick up a mission for people. Now, the, I've bulked this episode because of the way it's like panned out. Um, we have four minutes left to fertilize the rest of this field. Now we've done one part of it, or one half I would say, and then we've got to do the next half, which, excuse me, which is basically that little bit on the side there, and I don't know whether it's going to get done fully, but I'm hoping within the next four minutes we've got this done. It's a decent challenge, should be good enough to be done, but I'm hoping that we've done it. Because uh, this challenge gets us a nice five grand, was it? I think it was. Pretty sure it said five thousand. Uh, he's got all the equipment, I've just got, he just basically hired me as his worker. So we've come on um, to do his job because, you know, he's probably a busy farmer, you never know, he could be a really busy farmer, he could just be lazy like I am, and get other people to do his job for him, as in, you look at my farm, my farm's being done at the minute while I'm tending to someone else's, so yeah, like I said, he could be a very busy farmer, or he could just be like me and very lazy. And that is going to overrun. So, but he's got a slurry tank, so he's, in, he's on your. Let's see if we can line this up where I can get all of it. No, I can't. It's five grand and I don't want to lose it, so I'm going to have to come back and do that a little bit. But I think that should be lined up. Yeah, that should be done. Where well, we just have to do a little bit, which hopefully within two minutes we can do that a little bit. And I see why it gives you like 10 minutes. It did say 12 or 13, but it didn't give me 12 or 30 minutes. It started me off with like 10 minutes. I don't know whether I'm gonna get this done. It was a big farm to start off with, so that there is that bit. Like I accepted a quest, basically, um, for a big farm. This is a big, big one. Um, I won't be able to purchase this one at any point soon, but it takes a minute to get the thing back. I don't think we've done this. I think we might have failed this mission, but then again, there's plenty more missions out there that we will be doing. Um, because the way I'm going to do it now that I've seen this is I'm going to have workers work in my field, which is going to be blocked in a minute, so I'm not going to be able to get it done. And then I'm going to bounce around and start doing some missions for others, so then I can uh, earn a bit more money. I'm hoping that do not have like a backlash penalty of, well, you didn't get it done, so you know you have, you owe me this, blah blah blah. Did we, we did it. Oh, nice. We don't even have to finish the whole lot of it. We just we just got to get the majority of it done. Nice. We got five, just under five grand just for doing that. That was brilliant. There we go. Field jobs income. Field jobs income. Nice. Now, that's that done. Um, there is a worker block. Cool. Which we got the majority of it done, which is good to see. And the fact that you can actually do little in like missions inside it, I found that really good. Um, I might have to pick up a car doing that, you know. Right, so the harvester is the thing blocking there. So if we move the harvester like this, yep, and we go. You are seventy-eight percent full, so we're gonna have to take you over to farm fourteen get that done, while farm 14 is doing, I think, and then we can go to a different farm and get that done, now I know that they supply the equipment, 
that makes it a little bit easier. It finds it's like it also gives me like much more work to do in the series uh, instead of just sitting around like on things like not last episode, the episode before. I was sat around waffling. Um, just in case people don't know or understand what that means, I was sat around chatting inside this harvester, like because I sent the worker off, like I'm doing now, I'm talking. He was doing his work, and I was just sat there talking about like what he was doing. But now that, with that being said, what's going to happen now is worker B of Worker 1 will be harvesting, Worker 2 will be cultivating and that 5 grand we just got there you go, completed their task well done means that we can push this worker up to 3 because we just got 5 grand for doing a 10 minute job right whereas now, so I've been set up, yeah, done. Hire the worker, pop over to this one. 82%, it's not too bad. See, now this isn't going to be working primarily because we're not going to cultivate that one straight away. Uh, so the, it basically means we're going to just park this thing, this cultivator is going to be placed here this is just me doing my little uh, what was it, it was lowered no, that was exit detached was cute there we go right, this is me just doing my little pickups on my farm because now I need to go and grab my trailer because that harvester will be full pretty soon I'm not sure whether with this harvester or with like farm 14 uh, I'm not sure whether it's going to be fully harvested by the time it's full, but I don't think it will be. Can we attach? Come on, come on. There we go. Can attach that and take the cover off? It's empty. Uh, I've not seen it rain on this game yet. Um, I mean, I've done quite a few episodes, and this is like episode 13, and I've still not seen it rain. Um, so, yeah, what we're going to do is we'll leave the trailer here. With that, um, let's go up to this. Hello, Mr. Harvester, how much have you got? 85%. Right, so I'll have to keep an eye on that. Now, I've got 30 foot helper bees blocked by an object. No, you, oh, by me. Duh. <laughs> I'm the object. Right. 19 and 14 are getting harvested and seeded right now we did a job on 23 which gave us five grand now that was a big big farm to do now what i'm looking at is maybe if i run down here i mean it's like a little mission away um it's not like a major thing to go up. a car would be really good maybe getting like how much can we just go into the shop? Let's have a look. Uh, cars. 22 grand to buy it. And it's 2,000 to lease it. That's 45 grand to buy that one. And it's 5 grand to lease it. Now, that one looks like it's a better car. It looks better. But they both do the same amount of speed. Now, it looks like it's just going off looks, and I've got twenty two thousand, so I can I can outright buy the rodeo. Um, but is it worth buying the rodeo over than just doing that? Well, hang on, no. Uh, main color. We want you in orange. It cost me four hundred just for orange. So there you go. We'll just lease it for that bang. Okay, so now we've leased the car. That is where I think is going to be really good for us. Because now we've just done that. We've got a nice little car. That'll get us where we need to be. 
that can get us from the farms and pick up the money. So that was like 2,500 basically. It's got some speed to this car. Wow. Yeah, nice. Uh, a lot faster than the tractors and for some reason it's glitching back and forth on certain parts. We're going to get it to the farm. And once we've done that, we, 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 we slow down a little bit. Um, this is like a baby orange type looking colour. I would like a deep orange this oh it's not a bad looking orange uh, for any of you that don't actually know orange is my favorite color so that's why I went with orange um, basically now what we're gonna do is we're gonna drive all the way down here which opens it up actually because I'm pretty sure well, these cars can be used on certain things they can be used as like a pull trailer um, I think this is farm 20 here so if we park our car here it's the farmer there we go and then we jump here and we see what the mission is right you know I've been doing this my whole life and this is still my favorite part of the process seeing a healthy new crop start to pop up knowing that all your planning and hard work are going to pay off there's something beautiful in all that so what do you say we keep the field going strong with some fresh fertilizer eh? i'll gladly pay you 2500 what we just paid for the car to fertilize your field oh you got a spray i think it is right so let's start off boom straight into the quest i think he's got a spray one which might not. Yeah, it is a spray one. Hopefully, it gets it done faster. Attach that. And attach that. And just turn on the fertilizer. And let's go. And I think because it's a spray one, I can't really see how much it's doing. It will get the sides. I'm just going to go straight up this way, come back, go back, go back, keep doing it that way. we got five minutes. Right now, I can see that it's got a decent push out, sort of. So it's just a case of turning down like that, boom, and going back. And that is literally all it's going to be for this farm. It's only a small farm, or a smallish type of farm, so it's not too bad. Uh, so five minutes is a decent amount of time, I reckon we can get it done in that amount of time but the difference is with the last one the last one was a big farm so the slurry tank was a really good thing to have with this one that was looking that's looking like the type of fertilizer thing i wanted where it just sprays out um fertilizer hopefully with the way i'm doing it it's saving time and it's getting it done um because that big chunk that would that looks like there uh, it looks like it is getting done quite well now i can't see it, I can see it better there like that. It's like the views a bit different with it being green. It sort of messes with your eyes a little bit. But yeah, it looks like we are going to get this done quite fast. Which is actually quite good. Because the faster we get this done, the faster we can get that money back for leasing the car. And then we can go on and get another farm done. Um, by the time we've done this though, we might actually have to... What I'll do is once we've done this mission which shouldn't actually be that long now yeah so once this mission is done which the only thing yeah they i've just noticed it yep dingo done it noticed it right so the only thing that i know with this one is once i've done this which in the top right you've got your time one right next to it is that like um half circle thing which means that we're halfway done uh, it's not the time, but that's actually how much of the crops are done, I'm guessing. Basically, what I'm going to do is, once I've done this, I'm going to hit over to 14. I'm going to check if that worker is full. If he is, we're going to empty out the trailer, or the harvester into the trailer, and then we're going to take the trailer. So it might be a little bit of, um, instead of jumping in and doing a mission straight away, uh, like straight after we've done this one, they can grow. Nice, we got an achievement for doing a, a mission. We get an achievement. Um, and you always love cheat achievements. Right, so instead of actually jumping off and doing something else, uh, doing another mission, we're going to jump and see if we can get 
because it doesn't look like he's moving back and forth and they work or one which means we have to empty the, out the trailer or we have to fill up the trailer which means we have to empty out the harvest of that and once we've done that that's where it's going to be quite cool because then we can see how much money we're going to earn from the soybeans which is a little bit better for us because then we can see from like oh well the soybeans are going to be done at like this point can we go on and do this at this point and so on and so forth I need to see how much money I earn from soybeans because um, I am trying to grow as many soybeans as possible and I know 19 is harvested cultivated and in the process of being seeded which is even better which worked out quite well for us there is two minutes left on the clock and I'm not sure whether we're going to get this done it looks like we might uh, I'm hoping we do because like literally there's nothing I can do to speed this up I'm going back and forth back and forth in the best way possible to get it fertilized it might get done it might not get done I don't know whether that in the top right is like it's fully done like the little clock ticking up and down I don't know whether that means that that's how much of the quest is complete um, or that's how much of the field is complete because last time where I thought oh I'm going no we're, we're going to miss this we're not going to do it we're not going to do it it actually did it but I never actually saw that thing in the top I'm going to go on a different angle we need to get it done in a minute we got we might not we might not do this one we might not do this one we'll go a little bit further out ah yeah there you go it's going up fast so it was because of the way I was doing it ah <laughs> Hopefully we have done it because of that last minute looking and figuring it out. Um, this is going to be a close for comfort one for me because it's 30 seconds left. And it does look like we've got a little bit further. So if we just do that, can we get it done? Can we? What do you reckon? Bet some. Pause the video. Put it in the comments. Do we do it or don't we? Unpause. There we go. I think we have done it. I think we're doing it. I think we've just earned that money. We have. Bop. There we go. £2,400. And that was just literally paid for the vehicle's lease for a day. There we go. Right, now I need to do that. I'm enjoying these quests. I really am. I'm going to come back and do 15. Because uh, I think that's just a fertilizer job as well. Could be from the same person. You never know. But my driving is so poor. It's because this car's got some real major speed to it. Uh, we're going to check on the feed farm because I've not seen work, our work and move. So I think it's full. Which means if I can park up my car, my parking is so atrocious. And don't ask me why, I haven't got a clue. I don't understand why I just did that 360, but I did. Right. There we go. Um, let's just turn you. There we are. Now. Hey, I didn't say get back in the tractor. I said get into the harvester. I want to see how much. I don't think it's going to be full. So. Let's just like dismiss the worker for a second. Because I know with, with the workers it's a bit strange. What I like to do is I like to try and move the actual vehicle away. Before they start doing it again. Um, so what we're going to do is just dismiss that worker for a second. Let the trailer, once this harvester is fully done, then we're going to pipe in, we're going to jump in the tractor, 79%. So we're going to smash the cover on. And park the tractor up over here. Right. So I park in there, hire the worker again, pop to that one, not far, right. 
Uh, yeah, so basically that's it for this episode. Like I say, we got... We finished off Farm 23. We finished off that mission, which was actually quite good. That gave us five grand, or just under five grand. Then we had 19, the harvest done on 19. So we brought it over to 14. We just filled up that trailer from what was from 19 to 14. Hopefully by the time... 14 is finished we can throw that into the trailer and then that'll be done but we also earned a nice 2400 from that other farm uh, farm 20 which paid for the lease of this vehicle now in the next episode what we're going to do is we're going to pay for this lease even more by doing another mission so every time that my farm's doing something i'm going to be off doing a mission on a different farm to try and earn some money so it's more interesting on so what i'm doing as well as what my farm's doing and it gives a lot more things now that i found that it's going to be a lot better for us so again that's the recap that's what's going to be happening in episodes and so far to come and we're going to be making a lot of money from it all so with that being said i am going to end the video there thank you for watching it has been a pleasure recording for you don't forget to hit that subscribe button for plenty more videos to come don't forget to hit the like button if you like the video hit the dislike button if you didn't like the video that is entirely up to you i've been fiore you're all amazing and i shall see you next time